talk about the sad truth about this. This community shouldn't actually be here. The reason why is because all these bars are actually made out of knives. So that's the sad truth that this is this community is built out of something that shouldn't be here right now. What I found with my research is um, the use of equipment, that you, you're pushing, you can do things with equipment that you can't do with your body in terms of gravity, in terms of like what you can achieve with your body, and so it creates a sense of being like superhuman, which then expands your sense of self and what you can do. Pushing our limits to the boundary and seeing where our boundaries are, I feel like that also keeps us going. Our main priority is building communities like this, what we've got around with, and helping them train, helping people get into fitness, taking kids literally hanging out on the street and doing something more productive to even got a kid that comes to this park and now wants to be a personal trainer. I guess it, the, the thing about aerial that is kind of makes your brain and your body uh, so de develop in a really particular way is that you're always in a, a, a like unusual angle and try and having to navigate your body uh, like upside down or sideways where your brain has to adapt to understanding it that way. And I guess like for me calisthenics is like a new challenge for my body in that way. It's like taking it at all the different angles and like planes. But it's super creative as well, I imagine. Kind of yeah, that's why I really like training with um, with people because also like the skills that I have are very different so I can kind of come from different angles that they haven't thought of and so we can really feed into each other. So it's so hard training on your own because you're just like, well, I know what I can do, I'll just keep doing what I can do and yeah. you get quite bored, whereas if you're like with people, they're pushing you and you're seeing new things and like inventing new things. Going to the back of the start of the conversation, push the boundaries, <laughs> yeah. seeing how far can I really go and how far can someone else go, just keep going and going. Oh, let's get to training. <laughs>